up guys here at savers as you can see i'm gonna show you what it typically looks like going into a saver store and what i'm looking for all right so found this christmas item gonna check it out see what it's listed as and since christmas is right at the corner i expect this to sell so i'm gonna check that out Nothing. Scanned it on eBay. Nothing's listed. Just keep on looking. I usually go to the technology section. That's where I find most of the good items. It's in the back. Excuse me. Excuse me. All right, we're in the technology section. There's a lot of VCRs. They can go for a lot, but um, I still need to learn more about VCRs. I have one typically. I have one listed already. Um, something like this one. Sonic one. But um let's see what they got here. I found some potential with this LED light. I'm gonna go look it up and see if it's listed and what has sold like it's oh for two. Converter. Let's check it out. Potential winner. It's priced at two ninety nine. Lamp. I don't know how I, how I feel about this one, but uh, let's look it up. So there's no exact mass it, uh, matches, but there's some similar to that. So I'm thinking about that. I don't know if I'm gonna get that. It's also a little pricey, three, four bucks, but I don't know. Um, but I'm gonna check out some other stuff. I'm not trying to get a VCR though. That'll be a hassle to uh, ship. So here I'm 
looking for some popular toys and cars. Terminator. Between Lightning and Queen. Um, I typically don't go for game boards. Because I'm usually worn out and missing pieces and I don't want to check, so that's a bit of a hassle. We're just trying to make quick money and spend the least amount of time doing that. So board games are gonna go. Unless they're like new or like board games you've never heard of. This no, not new. Because it's not sealed. We need the clean pencil up, sorry. I typically don't get stuffed animals because they're like nasty, not clean. The one who was five bucks. I'm looking at this Snoopy and it says Macy on it. Instantly, I think of the upcoming Macy's parade. Potentially, oh, it's kind of worn out. I don't know. That is most likely a no. This is new. But I doubt anyone's going to be getting this since it's the winter time, but you never know. Uh, I, I think I'm gonna check this out. See what it's listed for. Let's see. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not getting that one. One was sold in August, only one. So I doubt it'll sell in November or even December. So that one's a no-go. I've never been here on a Tuesday. Didn't find much in the toy section except this stuffed animal. Um, I'm gonna go check out the mugs. I typically don't go for mugs. Mine haven't sold, but... Um, I know people that have sold mugs in the past. Um, Gary V loves mugs. He does all this eBay stuff and um, buy mugs at um, garage sales. All right, here are the mugs. Christmas mug. That might do very well. Santa mug, no go. Maybe I'll get it because Christmas is coming up and maybe someone will get it if I'm feeling risky. Got to take a couple risks. I've been wrong on some items and I've been right on some items. So passed up some items I could have sold. So I don't know. I got two items, which is good. I typically get, though, like three to five. I decided to put the Winnie Pooh back because shipping would be expensive. I could charge shipping. But, I don't know, I feel like that. People typically like free shipping, so it's less likely gonna sell if they have to pay for shipping. Oh, excuse me. Well, yeah, like I was saying, people are less likely gonna buy it if um, it isn't free shipping. So, I'm a I'm gonna put it back. And I also don't have like a box big enough for that. And I don't wanna buy one because those are expensive. So I feel like it's just not worth it. I think I'm just gonna go to another store and look for other stuff. But I'm still gonna get the cassette MP3 uh, player here. I'll show you on mining. This, this item, excuse me, um, this item, I feel like it's a steal. And yeah, 
and electronics typically do well, so this is a steal. Here's the listing, guys. I got a starting bid at $18.20. The buyer has the option of also buying it at $26.50. You might be wondering why I decided those prices, um, but I go over that in another video. Uh, I decided to charge around 5 bucks for shipping to make more of a profit. I bought this item at around $2, so by charging shipping, I can make more profit. Um, if they buy it now, I make about 28 bucks in profit, which is solid. Make sure to like the video, subscribe, and turn on bell notification, and I'll see you in the next one.